here we are. It's graduation time. Uh, not like we planned. I'm sure it's not like you were hoping for. Anyway, on behalf of the faculty and the staff in the school environment, I want to congratulate each and every one of you on graduating. I don't think it will happen, but I do believe something should go on your uh, graduation certificates saying that you graduated during a, during a pandemic. It's been challenging, it's been tough, and I'm proud of all of you to, to get through. At least most of you have had the experience of the in-person things that you get at Trent, and hopefully you've enjoyed your time here, and we've pushed you, and you're gonna go on to do better things. Uh Here we are. We've wheeled Tom out of his surgery to recognize this momentous day as you all go forth. We have Tom's cast wishing you well. We have the virtual signing of the cast. And, uh, and we want you to take, take note of the symbolism that this cast now represents <laughs> as we go forward and release another crop of ecological restoration students to the world. Congratulations, graduating class of 2021. Not only did you succeed in completing your degree, which is a major accomplishment in and of itself, but you did it during a global pandemic, showing true commitment and resilience. However, what I will remember most about your cohort of students is not that you persevered, but how you did. Because what I saw in my courses in a chaotic year like no other were students that responded with kindness, compassion, consideration, and understanding for themselves and for others above all else. So this is what will mark this cohort for me because I think this is your true strength. I urge you to carry this forward with you in everything you do next. I am incredibly grateful to have had this opportunity to play a role in helping you succeed and wish you all the best for the great things that you all have yet to come. I'll share a little story with you, just to, to give you hope and optimism. Uh, when I was graduating, uh, so same time as you, I had no idea what I was going to do. But once I graduated, I went, I got a summer job just working in a, in a factory. And uh, that was a few years ago. And, you know, I had no idea at that point what was uh, to lie ahead of me. So you're in that situation now, in some ways it's daunting that you're looking you know, ahead. But uh, I'm sure that, you know, you'll choose the right options. With the summer coming, and hopefully we can get rid of these masks pretty soon. Graduates, I'll catch you on the flippity flip. See you on the flippity flip. On the flippity flip. See you on the flippity flip. Really? Hi everyone, coming to you live here from where I've spent uh, most of the last year. I just want to say congratulations on this truly remarkable uh, accomplishment. You know, graduating university uh, anytime is a real accomplishment, but doing so under the conditions of this global pandemic and all the challenges that that entailed is truly remarkable. And um, I, I just want you to keep that in mind as you venture out beyond the university uh, into your career, knowing that you've accomplished this, knowing that you've proved to yourself that you can accomplish great things under very difficult circumstances. Um, so congratulations again. It was a real honor to spend time with you this year. You know, teaching and being with you has been, you know, such a, a, a highlight for me over the past year. One of the um, ways in which I started off the ecological restoration course that, that I teach is talking about the parts of my body which are broken down and have been replaced by other things <laughs> and talk about rehabilitation versus restoration and, and, the, and the meaning behind all of that. And so this is all for you. It's all for the future students. I've got another body part that I can refer to now as an analogy for, for, for the way we approach ecological restoration. Hi everybody, it's Heather Nickel from the School of the Environment. Some of you may never have seen my face. Some of you may have seen me in a mask. The big reveal. I want to talk to you face to face 
to wish you all the best for the future. Congratulations on finishing and graduating. It's been a pleasure to teach you. TSE graduates from the beautiful Lady Eaton Drumlin. This is Rex who barked during most of my lectures. We wish you all the best for the future. I was thinking today, we, we were going to have this session yesterday um, and then a treescape, a company moved in and took down a great big elm, or not an elm tree, but uh, an ash, ash tree next door. And there was too many chainsaws so we couldn't speak above that. And then yesterday afternoon, we had a, a little company called Three Sisters here looking at uh, putting in uh, native plant species uh, on the landscape. And I thought, here we are in the middle of a shutdown and the ecological restoration business is going pretty well. Hi everybody, I'm so very excited to be part of your graduation. Congratulations. Not only did you have to be clever to be here today, you also had to be heroic. So well done. This has been a very difficult year. It's exciting for me to know you're graduating. Congratulations, TSE graduates, for finishing your degree and overcoming all the challenges of this past year. You did it. You should feel very proud of your accomplishment and feel confident that you have the knowledge and skills to be successful in all your future endeavors. Hey, everybody. I just wanted to send you a quick video message to say congratulations for for all your hard work, which has culminated in you graduating uh, from the Trent School of the Environment. Trent students are always really impressive, always. But this year, more than any other, I've been amazed at all of the things that you have done. And you should be very proud of, of your work. If I was on the stage, I'd be giving each and every one of you a, a hug to say thanks for being so terrific in my classes. I will leave you with this, which is Hazel. Some of you may know her if you've taken my classes this year. She is remarkably quiet right now. Normally you will know her as a barking fiend who runs in the background and, and carries on, but maybe she's celebrating your grand achievement with a well-deserved rest too. Yeah, we've had a hard year in society in general, but I think in terms of our our profession and what we can learn from it and transfer it to other to other areas and back in, into it from those areas, uh, there's a lot that that I think ecological restoration can offer and that you can offer as graduates to to the world. Good luck to you. <laughs> we need you, and it's been really fun uh, being with you when we could be with you personally and less fun in video, but still fun. That's right. So congratulations. Congrats. All the best. Hello, Trent School of the Environment graduates. I want to congratulate you on finishing up your final undergraduate year and achieving your undergraduate degree. Uh, you did the work despite difficult circumstances and persevered through. Now you have the rest of your life to look forward to. Just want to say that I uh, wish you well in your future endeavors and Wherever your life takes you, whatever you end up doing, I hope that you will think about, appreciate, enjoy, maybe even help to protect our, our natural environments you have around you. Take care. Take a well-earned break, I hope. And then do keep in touch and let us know, know the amazing and fabulous things that you are doing. So I appreciate all the time that we get to spend together and best of luck on your new ventures. All can be repaired, all can be fixed and all can be put well. Congratulations, it was a great pleasure for me. Congratulations, graduating class of 2021. I wish you the very best of luck in your next adventure. It's exciting to me to know that so many of my colleagues, that is you, are graduating today. So please keep in touch and well done. Thanks, bye-bye. I hope you'll come back and visit us sometime. And I'm just delighted to be in a position to wish you well today. I wish you all the very best for the future and I hope that you stay in touch.